Hi, I'm the editor of the conservative news blog, Right Side Up. Today, I'm going to echo what the silent majority wants to say to illegals in our country. You have come into our country illegally by your own accord, not ours. Insisting on impunity is like breaking and entering into someone's home and saying, hey, but I did your laundry and folded your clothes while I've been here. Breaking and entering is still breaking and entering, and it's against the law. Please stop behaving like you are entitled to push your agenda in our country. You are not entitled, and we don't owe you. We are aware of the problems in your country, and we don't want those problems in our country. We want to speak English in our country and not feel guilty about it. Please don't have children in our country and expect Americans to be responsible for them. We know what Univision is, even if it's not broadcast in English. It's a network that puts illegal Hispanics on a pedestal and dishes out major propaganda for the illegal's agenda. This while simultaneously acknowledging and covering the violent murders, drug operations, domestic violence, fraud, and rape carried out by their people every day in America and abroad. Univision also showcases a wide variety of soap operas in Spanish that feature violent murders, beating of women, and the glorification of drug lords. In America, there is a growing movement to become vegetarian in order to protect animal welfare. You are taking that important progress backward because your diet is largely based on meat and other animal products. In some cases, like in Santeria, you needlessly sacrifice animals in satanic voodoo rituals. <laughs> you demand the right to drive, yet so many innocent American citizens have been killed by the reckless driving of illegals. The massive introduction of your severely uneducated people into our country has been lowering standards for Americans all across the board at an alarming rate. For example, signs are written in incorrect English. We must repeat ourselves over and over again as customers, only to have our requests filled incorrectly due to lack of English. You lower our standard of living by draining our resources, speaking and behaving lewd, taking our housing, loitering outside of our homes and in our streets, littering in our streets, selling drugs and engaging in prostitution and public indecency on our streets preparing food in a primitive fashion, putting stress on Americans that don't speak Spanish, and filling our streets with dozens upon dozens of illegal peddlers. We know that your representatives have infiltrated our Democratic Party big time. Your representatives have shamelessly turned political dialogue away from Americans in order to spotlight illegal Hispanics and enrich their own political careers. We believe that legal immigration should take America as a whole forward and not retrograde. Lastly, please figure out a way to cope with and improve life in your country so that you do not have to trespass into ours. It's one thing to deal with a few illegals. It's quite another to deal with a deliberate movement to take over our country. This is what Americans are staunchly against. This deliberate effort to dominate our country is positively abusive, exploitative, and meant to intimidate Americans. These are the facts, and we, the silent majority, refuse to be labeled anti-immigrant, dissenters, anti-Semites, anti-establishment, anti-this or anti-that, haters or deplorables for stating the facts. Americans want their jobs back, their housing back, their language back their resources back, their land back, and their opportunities back. Presently, America is going to hell because it's not investing in its people, but rather in illegal Hispanics of low class and education. There isn't time for political correctness, but it is definitely time for a referendum on illegal immigration and the politicians that support it. Coming soon, I will translate Univision News and Sanctuary City newspapers written in Spanish, to my fellow Americans. What are the messages inside of those free papers distributed all over your community, written in Spanish? 
the answer will surprise you. This is what you've been waiting for, and it's going to be massive. For Right Side Up News Blog, thank you for watching, and stay tuned.